Hi, I'm Nick. I didn't really know what to say there, so I'm just gonna restart it. Hi, I'm Nick. I don't normally do these video things, but I thought I'd give it a shot today. Yeah, I'm not so good at them. You should see how many mistakes I've made already. Anyway, I wanted to talk to you about something that's kind of important. You. You're important. Why? Why are you important? Is it just because some guy in a video, this, this guy that, who knows who this guy is? Is it because of me that you're important? No. First of all, self-worth has the word self in it, and so your opinion matters about yourself, okay? You are important. You exist on this earth for a reason, and that makes you important, you know? But it's not just what you think about yourself, okay? Because in the past, I struggled with this myself. How much am I worth? Am I worth anything to this world? But the truth is that God values you very much. That's the important thing. And so I wanted to share some verses from, with you that describe this. Describe your importance. So I'm going to read from the book of Ephesians in the Bible, um, starting with uh, chapter 2, verse 4 through 10. But because of his great love for us, God, who is rich in mercy, made us alive with Christ when we were dead in transgressions. It is by grace you have been saved. And God raised us up with Christ and seated us with him in heavenly realms in Christ Jesus, in order that in the coming ages he might show the incomparable richness of his grace, expressed in his kindness to us in Christ Jesus. For it is by grace you have been saved, through faith. And this is not from yourselves, it is the gift of God, not by works, so that no one can boast. For we are God's workmanship, created in Christ Jesus to do good works, which God prepared in advance for us to do. Focus on the last verse one more time. Verse 10 from chapter 2 in Ephesians. For we are God's workmanship. Okay. What does that mean, workmanship? Okay, it doesn't just mean that we're workers. It means that we are works of art. Okay, so the next time you go to a museum and you see something beautiful or you hear that beautiful song on the radio or um, on your playlist, these are works of art. Similarly, God has over 7 billion works of art here. This is his museum. This is his studio. This is where he's making beautiful things beautiful works of art that are each unique in their own way. Likewise, you are unique in your own way. You are beautiful. You are a work of God. You are a good work of God. You're not a mistake. It says that we were created in Christ Jesus to do good works. We are good works of art. And from it, when people see us, they can be blessed they can see the goodness of God. They can see their own self-worth through your worth. These are the things that God prepared for us in advance to do. God desires you to understand that you are important, that you are valued. Let's just pray for a second. God, I just thank you for this time. I thank you for who you are. I thank you that you love us. Please show us how much you love us. Show us why we are important when many things in our own lives would say that we're insignificant. We're so small in this universe, but I pray, Lord, that you would just show people, show them your love, show them that they are works of art. They're not just one in seven billion, but they are beautiful. In the name of Jesus, amen. So think about that today. Think about what your worth is, okay? When something rough happens in your, in your day, don't let it get you down. Understand that you are God's workmanship and God loves you deeply. All right, I'm gonna stop with my cheese. All right, take care.